Alright, so some time ago, I remember reading about Kurt Angle wanting to return to WWE, so he calls, uh, he calls WWE, I guess he calls Triple H, maybe, first, and then Triple H says, no, I don't want you back, so Kurt Angle couldn't get through, couldn't get past him, so he goes and calls Vince McMahon, and then Mr. McMahon tells him, oh, well, you gotta talk to Triple H, that's his call. So now, obviously, because Triple H doesn't want Kurt Angle back, Kurt Angle can't come back. So he's, he only has TNA left, I'm sorry. Uh, if Triple H doesn't want Kurt Angle back, I can't see him coming back. And even if he does come back, he shouldn't be wrestling anyway, because, I mean, he, he needs to take care of his health. You know, he's been getting injured and... Uh, you never know, he, he might endure some more life-threatening stuff, so if he were to come back for today, he, it'd have to be in a non-wrestling role as a general manager or something, because, um, yeah, wrestling, that's a no-no, no, uh, he's got to take care of his health, um, and... I mean, there's nothing wrong with non-wrestling roles. People are easily entertained by guys like Eric Bischoff and uh, Mr. McMahon when they're not wrestling. And then, even when they do wrestle, it's hilarious anyway. And you you don't always need to wrestle because you're always bossing people around. So, I can see Kurt Angle doing that. Yeah. Or at least managing another wrestler. It would be hilarious if he manages Jack Swagger. Um, and replaces Zeb Coulter. If not, joins Zeb Coulter and Swagger. Um, so you can be like their, their new mouth mouthpiece or Swagger's bodyguard or something. Um, but then again, he'd have to do some moves. Uh, Hopefully not too much that it hurts him, you know. So, uh, yeah. How many of you guys think Kurt Angle should return? And if he does return, how many of you guys think he should be in a wrestling role? Or a non-wrestling role? Alright. Yeah.